Yo, what is up guys? Tony here for today. I am bringing you an episode of Destiny 2. Now, if you guys follow me on Instagram and pretty much on Instagram, then you guys will know that for like a few months, I think I've been saying now, is that Destiny 2, once it comes out, I'm going to be doing YouTube again. And lo and behold, here it is. I'm ready. Let's do it. So, unfortunately, I just wanted to play the game without like having to record or anything so i ended up playing the game throughout with my hunter he's my my hunter the one i played since beta of the first game so i've been i've been with him for a while so i couldn't erase him i felt really weird in hindsight i i still think he looks badass although i don't have that haircut anymore so it kind of kills me so we're not gonna run a hunter again because i have a hunter so we're gonna run with a titan because titans are my second favorite I just realized. So I don't like the Awoken or the Exo. So I will make a female human. Uh, the Awoken I do usually for the Warlocks. So I already know how she's going to look. Where's that? There you are. That's not the face. This is the face. And. And black. This is how she's gonna look. I don't know why I love this style. Like, she looks super cool in my eyes. Also, horrendous. It's horrendous that they still have the same, literally the same, guys. They did not change any of the customization in this game at all. And that's atrocious. That's like literally a thousand points off of them. I am so disappointed that they didn't give us any more options. So I'm just going to skip all the cutscenes because there is a lot of cutscenes. Like, it was pretty cool, like, seeing the amount of cutscenes they had. It does feel more richer in story it, than from Destiny 1, I will say that. Like, I'm not going to fucking be a punk and be like, no, the game still has. It, it feels better, but, like, I beat it in one set in sitting, so... Although it was like, what, 9, 8, almost 10, like either 8 to 10 hours, but still like, I know a bunch of people who that for, for me, like at least for me, that was nothing. That was 10 hours is really nothing. Come to me when it's like 5 hours, you know, or, or 5 hours. Talk to me when it's like 100 to like 200 hours, like, but no, no, there's no buts because this is this is a first person shooter that wants to be an mmorpg and 10 hours for the main campaign fam like legion came out last fucking year and i'm still fucking doing legion shit like we just got a new patch last week so you know whatever so i will say if you've played Destiny, then this is going to feel very familiar to you. There's nothing huge in change, really. There's, like, little details. And I mean little details that, like, I was like, oh, cool. I didn't know you could do this now, you know? Like, when you slide, you can shoot now while sliding. That was cool. Or, like, you can aim while sliding. Little changes. But not enough to, like, make it fucking revolutionary, you know? Like... I'm, that's all I'm gonna pretty much be saying like oh I like this little change like Titans sit like this I like that that's dope the uh, hunters still sit down like the same but their leg one of the legs is completely down and the other one's up so I was like that's cool and then warlocks um, they kneel so I was like that's really cool I like that a lot but like I said nothing no change with substance because everything still feels the same like i yeah i get it it's a first person shooter but i've played first person shooters that have so much like difference in them like mm, what's a good game like prey prey was a good first person shooter i was like this doesn't feel like a first person shooter there's a bunch of games that don't feel like a first person shooter and this one sadly still feels kind of like the same like eve all oh, fam Oh, I'm really, I'm really annoyed that like, there was like, we thought we were getting new subclasses, but lo and behold, we get the same fucking subclasses, guys. Like, what the fuck? Kid you not. You get the striker with a little bit, little differences here and there. That's all it is. Same subclass difference here and there. 
it's not like that big ass tree that we we came to love it's just four specific slots but they're slot like they're things that like you would run so i'm just kind of like what did you guys really do with all this time like from what honestly the biggest feeling i get is the fact that like they probably finished the main game like destiny 2 game without expansion maybe sh earlier than expected and then everything was like all right guys take your time on the fucking expansions that's how it feels because like sure the world's big but it still kind of i feel like it still kind of follows what people would say about destiny one where it's like maps big but there's just not much to do like there's patrols and shit yeah that's cool but now it's just like oh we have a little bit more missions we have uh we have these other missions that are cool there's it's easier to get shit like i will say that it's so much easier to get stuff now like i don't know there's good things and then there's negative things uh i ended up getting the collector's edition for this too so that was really dope i will probably show you guys a video of that me opening it because i did record it but overall i i, I like I, i'd be like if you're into first person shooters and you like the sci-fi it's really dope i like it a lot i was kind of hoping they would give us a new class race anything new subclass but no not really because like when i when i saw the sentinel i thought we were gonna get the sentinel on top of like the shield the bubble like two separate subclasses I, that's what i thought we were gonna get and i was like i, I was really pumped up for that because that sounds cool in my mind but no we got more like along the lines of like sentinel pretty much is the evolved form of um of the defender i think it's called but you can still use the bubble but you can use the shield now i just i don't know how to feel about it in my head i'm just kind of like i don't like it. like if this was if this was any other game i'd be like this is horseshit but since it's destiny i'm just kind of like i expected this and in my head that makes it okay i guess i don't know i overall like this this is a change this is it guys you're looking at it and i think i can slam again well there it is yeah i can slam again and then i can do this which is an insta kill for everything so you're telling me you get multiple slams that's okay but the hunters um what is it called strider whatever their reach is horseshit but you know whatever mother my, none of my fucking business apparently so overall i'm just I'm disappointed that they didn't give us more because here I thought we were going to get an actual like fucking huge like new subclasses. I was expecting like void like not not void. I'm sorry. I was expecting like the light or like just something else like fr like frost. That would have been cool. But you know, they, get, they even gave us a weapon for the pre-order bonus. Which is basically a gun made out of fucking f frost. Like you shoot ice. But they made it. They made it. Um, oh fuck. I always forget the names of this, these dumb things. They made it. Um, the electricity one. I don't forget what it's called. Arc? Yeah. They made it arc. That's 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 the that's the damage it does. Arc. Yet you shoot fucking ice. Like that's that type of lazy shit that I expect Destiny that from Bad from Bungie. That's the type of lazy shit I come to expect from them, and that's why I don't like it. That's why I'm not okay with it because I shouldn't be okay with it. It's one of those things where, if it was any other company, if it was any other company that you know makes great games, like if it was, ah, uh, people who made fucking Witcher or people who made um, what's Mass Effect mass effect like two and three and one you know them not the fucking horse shit that we got if it was those guys you'd call them out on it you'd be like no 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 no. this is lazy you're this is a shortcut don't do that but because it's blizzard you're just like they're like they're like the little brother who 
just it's just a fuck up and you're just like it's the best you could do bro that's that's what bungie is to me now they're the little fuck up brother that i'm just like i mean at least you made a game good for you buddy which is sad because once upon a time they made great games <clears throat> and it that's what kills me the most is that i'm not okay with it like i really am not okay with it but what the fuck am i gonna do about it like this is where we're at in a day and age where a company can make a shitty product but because people like it so much like i like destiny a lot i like what it is it's a the world's beautiful i just wish that the people who who handled it handled it better because if it was like me and a couple of my friends handling it we'd make this shit into a fucking multi-million dollar like it'd be huge as shit dude it'd be so fucking huge we wouldn't be doing any of this lazy shit that they've they've been doing like for them to use arc for a frozen gun i was just like damn that's oh man that's like a new level of lazy i did not even know existed and that's why i'm not okay with it that's why it, it that's why it just bothers me because i know people are okay with it i know i know the fucking the fucking uh bungee tards are just like you, you see you gotta understand in science and i'm just gonna be like bro electricity ice like don't don't try to fuck no bro like just it would have been so fucking dope if they added a new um a new burn like fr like frost uh what else they have void which is based obviously darkness so light they have uh fire electricity so you know they could have done a bunch of shit with it they could have done earth and called it like um gaia or some shit that would have been fucking awesome can you imagine like one of these big fucks literally protecting themselves with earth that's what i want I don't, none of this fucking bubble shield that's like oh it's green so it has to be fucking earth you know it would have been awesome to see their like the elemental like the element actually protect them that would have been awesome but that's something else entirely so yeah like what what do i think about the game overall um i'd give it like a really solid seven out of ten like and I know, like, that sounds really weird because I've been I've been I've been doing nothing but bitching the whole fucking video, but and this is the thing, this is the thing because it's Bungie, I have a different uh, score system. I don't know. I just I just have like different expectations from 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 Bungie now, and it's sad because like I know they don't give a fuck about their own reputation. As long as it gets some money, who cares, right? And it's sad because, you know, it's one of those things where it's like, obviously people are going to buy it, bro. Like, Bungie, you guys were made from fucking Halo and shit. So obviously people are going to buy it. I'm going to buy it because I'm an idiot. I fucking don't like great games, apparently. I obviously love a oh, shitty time. Not saying this is a shitty game. By far, it's actually way better than its predecessor way better actually now that i think about it but it's just there's just few things i'm just kind of like you guys could have done better you guys could have done better let's let's be real about this like don't don't act like this is like oh we didn't notice this like you you noticed it bro just a little like look at that shit i did like well, how many bro that's too much for a titan that's way too much bro i'm sorry um like titan is one of like my second favorite for sure like but that's too much bro you're a tank you're the tank of the fucking game you can't be doing two fuck three slams four slams what the fuck bro you need to chill but yeah fucking hunters still have the their pea shooter that turns into six but it lasts like all of like 1.5 seconds hunters also have the shitty strider that has like no fucking range and then what else the Night Stalker, which does not have auto aim anymore. That's I learned that the hard way. So, yeah, I I'm not really really that mad about it, honestly. More annoyed, I would say. More annoyed about the hunters' changes. So yeah, overall, I um I enjoyed the game. I just a few things here and there that I'm just kind of disappointed at. 
but what can you do with Bungie? Like, someone I, I hold in high regards and, like, I know they will never fucking do me wrong is Ko- Kojima-san. Or, um, I'm sorry, uh, Hideo Kojima. Hideo Kojima. He has to be one of the fucking, like, uh, one of the people I trust most in this world. Like, I w- like if he's like, I'm going to make a game. I'm going to make a Destiny game. I'm going to be like, oh, fuck, Bungie. Y'all can- you guys are not going to have a game anymore because he fucks up no game. Like, he- dude, the man's legendary. He made Metal Gear, which is my favorite series ever, obviously, for obvious reasons. Shit's dope. Like, the ma- Zone Vendors? Come on, fam. I'm really excited to see um, the new game he's making, but that's for another conversation. So, overall, will I be playing Destiny a lot? Yes. Yes, I will. But, I have to remind you, I love to play shitty games. I played Nuke Dukem, the the remade one, for PS3. I played that like four times because I like to play shitty games. I don't know what it is. So, yeah, I will call it an episode now. I really like this. This is really cool. I'll call it an episode. I don't want it to be too too long. But, like I said, I will be doing more. So, if I don't do it on a daily, I will do it on a bi-daily. I don't know. I'll do it is what I'm trying to say. So, I'll see you guys later in the next episode. But for now, I'm probably going to go chill. So, I'll see you guys later. Peace.